guys, welcome back. This is part two of our look at the Oslin Entourage Stroller, and today we're looking at the accessories. We're gonna look at the sit and stand accessory that turns it into a sit and stand, the second seat that turns it into a double stroller, and the car seat adapter that turns it into a travel system. Now, if you missed our full coverage video that talks about it as a single with the market tote, the cargo bag, and this front seat, go ahead and click that up there. That will take you to our first part of the video. Now this is just about the accessories, so let's start with the sit and stand. Now the sit and stand accessory for the Entourage, it's this cute little bench and it also comes with a platform here for them to stand on. I've already put the platform in and the bench accommodates up to 50 pounds, which is fantastic, especially for your older toddlers. Now it's gonna go right on the frame, um, snaps in just like that, then it has a little lever here and you fold it down. It sports a three-point harness to keep them safely in the seat. And I love that the seat is lightly padded, so it's not just a hard seat, it does have a little padding in it. Now this is great for those older toddlers that are part-time riders, um, and like 50 pounds, that, you know, my seven-year-old is only 50 pounds, so definitely you could get an older kid to sit there, they could set their feet here, or they could stand on this platform and hold on right here. So I really like this accessory, and you don't have to remove it when your child's not riding. You just go ahead and lift that piece and it folds up out of the way. You can even leave it attached when you're folding it, and you can bring the seat in, or you know, the child, you know, in order to get the child a little bit more room, you will want to expand the stroller like that. So I really like this sit and stand accessory. I just love how that it, it folds up and you never have to remove it when you're folding. So let's go ahead and look at the second seat. Now let's talk about the second seat. The second seat turns it into a full-size double. It accommodates six months up to 35 pounds. It's a little bit smaller of a seat. It's a little narrower, 12 inches wide, and a measurement from back of the seat to the canopy of 21 inches. So it's a little shorter too. So you would put your smaller kid back here as long as they're not under six months. The front seat has a weight capacity of 50 pounds. So that's why it's a little bit, your bigger kid will probably go in front. Now this seat does parent face at all times. It does not turn around. So your front seat's gonna face out. This one's gonna parent face. Um, it has a padded adjustable five point harness, which I love. It has a great three panel canopy and on the back of the canopy is a mesh window that not only has a magnetic closure, but it's mesh so it allows air to circulate through. There are also different recline positions and it's one handed. You just squeeze that bar and it goes back to there. And that is the reason why it's only six months and up. It's because it doesn't have a flat recline like the front one does. And then you go ahead and you put it up like that. Now, you can leave the seat attached when you fold the stroller, and I love that. And you can also remove it. So let me show you quickly how to remove it, because um, you do have to read the book, otherwise I'll just show you. So you go ahead and there's a strap in the seat, you pull that, you lift this, and it's gonna fold forward. Okay, so you have to fold forward all the way. That is how you would fold the stroller with it in that position. If you wanted to remove it all the way, there's two buttons here, you lift those, and the seat pops right off. So let me go ahead and show you how it is folding it with this seat attached. Now, you would do the exact same thing that I did with the thing is you would fold it all the way forward. You would push these together. Go ahead and lift that like that. I can do the whole thing on my knees. And then over here, there is a button. You're going to lift it and that folds like that. So look at how compact that is for a double stroller with the second seat attached. I really, really love that. It locked into place. Um, it does um, have a standing fold if you wanna see that as well. Um, and you could just wheel it behind you like luggage if you wanted. I just love how seamlessly this seat just kind of folds in with it. And then to unfold it, you go ahead and you find the safety button. You lift that up. Like that. Now if you want to use the second seat, you definitely have to expand the stroller, otherwise there isn't going to be much room. Now if you had a smaller baby in there, you could go in the in-between position, but you couldn't go all the way in. But you wouldn't have to go as far as that if you didn't want to. If you have a taller child, you probably might want to give them a little more room, but that definitely works as well. Now finally, I wanted to show you how it turns into a travel system with the sold separately car seat adapters. They work with Nuna, Maxi Cozy, and Cybex. I have the Cloud Q here, and I wanna show you how it turns into a single travel system, or if you get the back 
car seat adapter, you can turn it into a double travel system for twins. Now I already have the adapters. They replace the baby bumper bar on the front seat. Then you go ahead, I just click the cloud cue right in there, and that is gonna be my single um, travel system. Then I could go ahead and put a second car seat right up here. And the car seat is gonna ride high, so it's gonna set here. I'm gonna have total access to that baby. So if you wanna put your baby in the back, just make sure you get this car seat adapter for the back. But if you want them in the front, they're two separate car seat adapters, two separate purchases. But if you have twins, it's a great option to have a stroller with two infant carriers. So there you go guys, that's how to turn the Oslin Entourage into a full-size double, a sit and stand, or a travel system with the sold separately accessories. So let me know if you have any questions. Give me a comment down below, which is your favorite accessory? Do you like that it turns into a double? Do you like the sit and stand? I like the sit and stand the way that it folds up and out of the way when not used. So leave me a comment, let me know. Don't forget to check out babygizmo.com for a ton more baby gear reviews. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And on Facebook, we have a great community of moms and dads talking all about about baby stuff, so join us there as well. So I'll talk to you later. I'm Holly from Baby Gizmo. Bye guys.